Hello, YouTubers, friends, compatriots, bootlicker shills, death slays, surf peasants, vassals, minions, meat sacks. I'm a useful idiot. Welcome. And uh, let's go global and uh, talk about these Hillary Clinton emails. And I did a video before, um, actually quite a while ago now, but it seems to be breaking in, in the alternative press a little more now about the Clinton emails about Libya. And we find out that the Libyan inter intervention, of course, was all trumped up, so to speak, and uh, that there was no humanitarian effort and we weren't helping some new uh, revolution. It was all about French interests and undermining the um, Pan-African uh, currency that Gaddafi was developing uh, to basically take over uh, for the U.S. dollar and the French franc and other European uh, monetary uh, units that were being used in Africa, mostly for oil. So, uh, Anyway, we find kind of the same thing in Syria in a way. These other new Hillary Clinton emails uh, between her, and generally between her and Max Blumenthal. Uh, this one from July 2012, and once again provided to us by the wonderful WikiLeaks. And uh, in, it turns out that the Israeli intelligence considered a potential Sunni Shiite war in Syria as a positive development for Israel and the West. And uh, so it, it certainly uh, explains some of the, the uh, anomalies we see in the fact that Israel has is supported, uh, seemingly supported ISIS and um, Al-Qaeda, uh, particularly in Syria and also in, in Iraq, and, uh, and that it also uh, confirms the, Israel's interest in destabilizing that region and fragmenting it and using the Sunni-Shiite divide. And, uh, and so it falls uh, well in line with uh, another video I did before about an Israeli plan called the Yidon Plan, that calls for exactly this, the destabilization of uh, Syria and Iraq and, and its neighbors, its belligerent neighbors, as well as the uh, destabilization, fragmentation, and then the, the method used being a sectarian war. And uh, part of this is a plan, of course, to ultimately destabilize, fragment, and uh, have a sectarian war in Iran. And interestingly enough, this very same email exchange uh, between Hillary Clinton and uh, uh, Blumenthal and uh, also talks about uh, this plan to destabilize and destroy Iran. And in fact, a, a direct quote is, the fall of the House of Assad could well ignite a sectarian war between the Shiites and the majority Sunnis of the region drawing in Iran, which in the view of Israeli commanders would not be a bad thing for Israel and its Western allies, unquote. And this would serve to uh, distract Iran from its nuclear activities as well as it maybe eventually destabilize and topple uh, the government in Iran. So, uh, so in itself, uh, an interesting uh, uh, leak, uh, the fact that it involves Hillary Clinton and uh, involves Israeli intelligence uh, makes it uh, an interesting component to a lot of other things I've talked about in that region and a lot of things uh, everyone has talked about in that region, particularly the co complex relationships, uh, not the least of which is the one between Israel and Al-Qaeda and ISIS, whom they, uh, for all intents and purposes, have been supporting. And this uh, makes clear why that would be, because they've known all along that this is in their uh, best interest. And, uh, and then, of course, the, the more damning aspect of this is it just falls in line with the Yunnan plan and all, and all these other plans that the United States and the Project of a New American Century and the, uh, the uh, uh, neocons like Dick Cheney and, uh, and then these Israeli plans uh, all seem to get uh, uh, confirmed over and over by these little notes that appear. So, uh, interesting story. I'm a useful idiot. Don't you be one, too.